the Sunday Night Anthem, delivered by Uber Eats. Patrick Mahomes, you know, we all know about his physical gifts, but what the Ravens coaches have been talking about is what he's been doing mentally now at the line of scrimmage, putting his team in the very best play possible. So when you can take what this guy is doing mentally with what's possible for him physically, tough to beat. We know not very often the Ravens are home underdogs. They are tonight. How did they pull off the upset? Well, Lamar Jackson's going to have to make some Lamar kind of plays out here. But this is also a big play defense. They're going to attack. They're going to blitz. They're going to take chances. And they have to get hits on Patrick Mahomes. If we learned anything from the Super Bowl, that's the easiest way to beat him. Must see matchup. Mahomes, Jackson, Chiefs, Ravens next on NBC. Sunday Night Football is brought to you by the all-new Hyundai Tucson, our best Tucson ever, and by Untuck It, shirts designed to be worn untucked, untuckit.com. The game, the Walmart Plus 4K Skycam. Get more out of game day with Walmart Plus, a membership with free same-day delivery on fresh groceries and more. This fall, a new journey begins, filled with remarkable stories, leading to a moment when for the first time in history, the two biggest events in the world will take place together. It will be once in a lifetime. NBC Sports, Sport, home of Super Bowl Welcome 56. Welcome to the following presentation of the National the Football League. Of the National Football League. People, we've been lied to, deceived, duped. Hoodwinked! Good things don't come to those who wait. No, sir. Good things come to those who take it from you. Patrick Mahomes on the real touchdown. Lamar Jackson. Waiting? That's for kindergartners. You want an MVP? Grab one. 
You want a shiny new Lombardi? Take it off the shelf and put it in your bag. And don't start fact-checking me. David, he's a dumb diddly. He's not waiting. He's working. He's not patient. He's peaking. Patience is for suckers. Winners take what's theirs. Sunday night football! There they are, our leading men, as we go to our leading lady, Michelle Tafoya. Michelle. Well, Al, it's not often that injuries are a major story in week two of the NFL season, but for Baltimore, they are. The Ravens have a league-high 15 players on injured reserve. Starting in late August, they lost their top three running backs to season-ending injuries in the span of 12 days. Tonight, the big concern, the offensive line. All-pro left tackle Ronnie Stanley is out with an ankle injury. So former Steelers Pro Bowl left tackle Alejandro Villanueva, who started at right tackle last week, will move over to Stanley's spot. Tyree Phillips is on injured reserve, so Ben Powers will play left guard. And Patrick McCarry will step in at right tackle. Both of those guys starting in those positions for the first time in their careers. John Harbaugh told me it's an injury league. We're deep enough to withstand this, but we are a work in progress, and we need to find ways to win while we are. Michelle, there are so many guys on injured reserve. They'd like to bring this guy back if they could. Ray Lewis, out of the tunnel, he comes doing the dance that he made so popular. Ravens linebacker for both of their Super Bowl championship teams in 2000 and 2012. And he gets the crowd as the bullies did stir it up. And even Mahomes is enjoying it. He gets the, the visiting guys juiced as well. Orlando Brown was the Raven last year. Now the left tackle for Kansas City. He looked from high above on a beautiful night. Up in the low 70s, KC won the toss. The Fur Harrison Butker to kick off to get this thing underway. Devin Duvernay back to receive. And away we go for Baltimore. Where the Ravens will begin 